Thanks for joining us today on the Cloud Harmonic Security Spot. Today's topic is Global Protect Connect Methods. Palo Alto Global Protect VPNs have a couple ways that they can be configured. Today we're looking at connect methods. A connect method is where the administrator decides how and when the VPN should connect. We have four different options when it comes to a connect method. Go to a connect method, hit network, go to your global protect, portals. We don't have a portal, so we're going to add one. Then the agent tab, add, the app tab, And here we have connect methods. So we have four different connect methods. The most widely used connect method, on-demand. The on-demand connect method allows the user to decide when they need to connect the VPN. Next one we have is user logon. The option automatically enables Global Protect connection after the user logs into their computer. If the user is using single sign-on or SSO, the agent uses the Windows credentials of the user to authenticate the Global Connect portal in a process that is completely transparent to the end user. This method requires the authentication profile to use the same verification service as the login process, so Active Directory or RADIUS. The next one we have is pre-logon. This option preserves pre-login and post-login services provided by corporate infrastructure, regardless of where the machine is located. Global Protect establishes a connection even if the user is not logged into their machine. This practice means that a company can create a logical network that maintains the security and management features normally achieved by a physical network. Tunnel selection and establishment happens before the user logs in based on machine certificates deployed outside of Global Protect. The next one we have is a hybrid method called pre-logon and on-demand. This hybrid connect method combines both pre-logon capabilities to authenticate the user before they log into the endpoint and the on-demand capability to allow users to establish a connection with the external gateways manually for subsequent connections. This is useful when they forget their password or work with their help desk to change their password and require access over a pre-logon VPN tunnel versus their regular on-demand tunnel. Well, that's all we have for today for the security spot. If you'd like to give us some feedback or comment below, let us know if you have any other topics that you'd like us to cover in our security spot. Thank you from Cloud Harmonics, and we will see you next time.